today we are making a DIY shampoo and it's so easy to make it gives my hair a lot of bounce a lot of shine it's the very first shampoo that I made when I when I first started to really take care of my hair I hope you like the result let's get to it I'm also going to show you how to make this into a deep conditioning mask for your hair. Use olive oil, apple cider vinegar, an egg, lemon juice, an applicator bottle, a whisk, a bowl to mix everything up in, a shower cap, and measuring spoons. All right, let's add the egg. Two tablespoons of olive oil. One tablespoon of lemon juice. Half a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. Whisk it all together. Add it to your applicator bottle. Now let's use it in our hair. So my hair is dry, I mean really parched. So I'm going to section my hair into some more manageable parts. So I'm going to add the mixture to my scalp first. And really work it into my scalp so that it helps with growth process and removing any buildup from your scalp. And next, I'm going to apply the mixture to my strands. and work my way down all the way to the ends of my hair. Work those ends, baby! As we know, our ends need more TLC than anywhere else in our hair. Alright, let's do the next section. We're going to repeat the process. Separate your hair, massage into your scalp. But this time I added some water because my hair was drier than I expected. And it helped make the process a little bit easier because my hair was so dry. You really want to work your shampoo into your hair so that it can receive all the benefits of all the ingredients we use to make the shampoo. And again, twirl your hair so that you can form your bantu knot. Apple cider vinegar helps to restore the natural pH balance of your hair. It helps close the cuticles. It keeps your hair supple and also encourages blood circulation to your scalp. And the lemon juice it aids in removing dirt and grease and grime and build up from your hair. Eggs are rich in vitamins, minerals, and proteins, and those are, are awesome for your hair. And it's definitely the best thing to use if you want those curls to pop, if you want your hair to get thicker and shinier. Olive oil, whenever used in your hair, it makes your hair more manageable, soft, and it's 
also an excellent moisturizer. Once I was finished with all the Bantu knots, I covered it with a shower cap. Now if you want to do just a shampoo, you can leave this for 20 minutes. If you want a deep conditioning mask, I suggest you leave it for two hours and in this case, I did just that. Two hours created this result, so this became a deep conditioning mask for my hair. Be sure to rinse, then cleanse with your favorite conditioner. Next, I did a braid out. Check out my video here. So there you have it, my DIY homemade shampoo. I hope you like it. it Give my hair a lot of bounce, a lot of shine. I love the results and I hope you try it as well. If you try it, let me know in the comments below if it was really easy to do as well. So give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe and find me on Instagram and Twitter at ife360tv.